Let me try this. Holy! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> wow! The Controlled Chaos Expert Challenge is very random. It is even more random with random random clan selection. In this run, I happened upon the most standard clan combination, Hellhorn Awoken, despite going random random. Also, for the random cards that's coming from the comp prepared mutator, they are always random and there will always be some good and some bad cards. It's not about getting rid of all the bad cards because it's pretty much impossible to do so. Rather, just put as many good cards as you can into the deck so you will always have some good cards to play every single turn. This run was when I got the 40 plus cards achievement. For most of the fights, including Seraph, I only get to play one card once unless it has holdover. But most of the time, including Seraph, I only need to play them once. So here is the rest of the run. It was recorded before the Friends of Foes patch, so some cards might be different, but the strategy is still the same. Oh, I will try go to Wait, I think I can go for a Yimp deck if I am offered Transcendent. If I'm offered Transcendent, I think I can make it make a Yimp deck work. So I would go for a Rage Does Not Decay Collection of Tails. Yeah. Oh, right. Uh, I just realized it's Surf the Chase. But does it matter? Does it matter? Do I just go for it? Do I just brute force it? I think I'm, I'm just gonna brute, brute force it. If it works, if it, it I mean, if it works, it works. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work, I guess. <laughs> because, yeah, I, th I think I'm just gonna brute force it. Because I already picked this, this uh, artifact. I do have vent. I think I can take it. Now I might be really unlucky. Oh, I just realized I have thorns plus the plus the this guy. Yeah, I mean, right. I just realized I have this combination here. I mean, if I have this combination, I'm I should be okay because this combination is is borderline. Basically game breaking. It's not borderline game breaking. It is game breaking. Uh, okay. Yep, let's just go. This is just really straightforward. I know that Surf the Chase will definitely uh, cleanse my rage and thorns, but I think I can stack enough so that he won't be able to do that. Molting him. No, it's fine. And do I want another wine grasp? Sure. It's for gra it's for pulling the back line to the front. Uh I don't have any banner units. Oh I have our yips. So I think this is okay. I mean I do get to end this. Horned Warrior versus Branded Warrior. I think I will just take a Horned Warrior. Oh, there's Card Duplicator Service. <laughs> Eternal Stone. 
I'm thinking of just going straight for the for this. I mean, I'm hoping for a transcendent. If I don't get one, then yeah, I guess too bad. But hopefully, I get one. That should be fine. All right. For the, so the yimps, I have to kill them with. Oh, I do have a the destroy impressive here to kill them with. Hmm. Yeah, I think it's fine. This should be fine. I mean, I need. Oh my god. I was like, I need thorns. Or not thorns, I need spikes. But then the reconciler is gonna hit me. Do that. Put this guy up here. Uh, okay, sure. All right, so sharpen for sure. Oh, this guy to the front. Okay, armor for sure, and I guess armor again. I'll just do that. Uh, 5 HP? There, and I will do this to sharpen. Okay, well, you know, I'm going all in on this uh, rage build, even though I, even though it is the serve the chase, I'm going all in on the rage build. I probably need, I probably need another minion because I can't deal with double heavy units right now. Oh my god! <laughs> Guild marker is so good. The resonant shard, I have collection of tails, so the resonant shard is, is so much better with the collection of tails. I think it has to be the resonant shard, even though I really want the guild marker. <laughs> Another horned warrior? Oh my god. I don't think it it is any of these. This is... it's not offering me good Hellhorn units. I would take a, an Alpha Fiend. I mean even Demon Fiend I think it's good. But I don't need a Steel Worker right now because the Horn Breaker Prince is already a tank. And Horned Warrior... I mean it's not good enough. Uh, Umbra, Melting, or Stygian? Rare. Umbra? Rare Draft. Umbra has multi-strike, but probably I do need a spell, like the Ancient Synergy. <sighs> or Siren Song. Actually, Ancient Synergy is good. It's... I can hold over that. Yeah, 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 yeah. I have a lot of spells because I started off with a random deck, right? But I have a lot of spells. I can use that. Hold over it and I can use it. Okay, so it's that one. I mean... I think I'll just set up on the second floor. I mean, there's really no need to set up on the first floor.
All right. So. So right now I'm looking for a uh, multi-strike on the Horned Warrior, which I think is gonna be like a really good addition. Uh, this, this. One horn's tome. I actually think this is this can work. Oh, and deranged brute. I mean, I'm going straight for the rage build. I think I do need the extra card draw. So, if I go for the card draw. I need another floor so that I don't get cleansed every single turn by the Seraph. I need to set up another floor. Probably gonna be a an Imp floor. So I think I do need to keep the Horned Warrior. So I have Deranged Brute and Hornbreaker Prince on one floor and uh, probably the, the Fledging Imp. And the Fledging Imp will be cycling. And I have Horned Warrior on another floor with the rest of the imps. I didn't get a Transcendent this round. Maybe I'll get a one after fell. <laughs> Maybe. I mean right now, it doesn't seem like the drawing is a problem. And I do need fell's Remorse to play a One Horse Tome. I, lower the, I need to lower the cost of One Horse Tome. So I... Do you think the space choice is not the right choice? Okay, so over here, this is... Uh, do I want the achievement of getting 40 cards or more? Oh my god, okay, I'm, I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna try it. I might fail because I have all these random cards in my deck. Uh, derange the brute. Wait, I have card duplicator in the shop. Oh my god, I can just duplicate the deranged brute. Oh my god. Oh, fuck. <gasps> oh, I, I, I should have just gotten space and play two deranged brutes. Okay, I guess I made a mistake. Uh, this should be okay. Reroll for Edge Prior. Okay, we have the multi strike seraph, so. I mean, I don't really need that. Well, so uh, maybe I do want to purge. I'll just pick up another card later on for 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 the forty card achievement. Spikes four. Spikes four should be okay. Now I don't want to set up too high because the boss uh, has increased attack. Oh, fuck. Okay, okay. I... Oh, my god. That was... I... I... That was wrong. <laughs> that was, uh, wrong. Wrong. That was just wrong. Oh, 
Okay. Hmm. Now, can I afford to put the Martyr Shield on? So, 43. He's gonna get hit. It's gonna be another Revenge 3. That's what? 6 plus another 12. 18 plus another another 3, 21, 64, 64 plus 40, 100 and something, this should be fine, oh I, really? Oh I missed the collector, huh. I, I didn't know that I would mix, miss the collector. I think I would just cycle that. And I'll put the welder helper here. Uh, that is fine because they have swords. Hmm. That is fine there. Okay. I think I'm just gonna heal. I think I will take that, in case I get the Hidden Passage or the Restoring Retreat, just in case, right? Uh, Branding right. Yeah, it is 20 armor. Focused Growth. Sure, it is card draw. And it does heal me a bit. Alright, so... Okay, I'm gonna just use the shop duplication service instead of using this here. But, like, Merchant of Trinkets, I have no use for Merchant of Trinkets. Let's just go for the cave. Evans Gold. Petty Theft. Let's go for Petty Theft. I mean, you can never have enough backline damage spells. I don't think I need to duplicate any card. Right now? I mean, I do need to go to a Merchant of Magic that is right after. I mean, I can always duplicate it in the shop, so it's not really like prevalent, it really like encouraging for me to duplicate in the Hellvent. Okay, plus 6 attack. That is a lot. That's a lot of attack. Ah, uh, that's a lot of attack. It's just that my deck is too is so big that I I'm not sure if I can I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it because as long as I can draw one thorn I'm I'm basically set horn breaker all right you know what I'm gonna sack this unit. I can't get the collector. Uh, what I do that? What?
Okay. I mean, I think these units can just go. Hi. There we go. Okay, so... No, 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 that over there. This guy has the multi-strike. Why am I buffing the Hornbreaker Prince when this guy has the multi-strike? Alright, Infernal. I mean, Infernal is really good if it's Holdover or Yimpian Box. This will help me, I think. Infernal. This will help him more. Uh, none of those. I need the Merchant of Magic. Holdover. Now I did say that Holdover the Inferno is good, but also Holdover the Spreading Spores. It's <laughs> it's okay. It's not great. Oh, and also Holdover the Ancient Synergy is really good too. Okay, I'm gonna go for the Inferno and lower the cost. This, I think, uh, I would do it on Vent. Vent is more important right now. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of the two train stewards that are left in the deck. Okay, I can reroll. Let's reroll. I forgot to lower the cost of this. Uh, right. <laughs> That's that is really important to have. That is okay. All right. All right. Let's go. Okay. So. Really? That is sad. Hmm. Okay, play this guy, play this. Oh my god. Good. Oh my god, <laughs> I can't play the one horse tome because of these sweeping units. I'm just going to go do this. Oh my god. Okay. It hits me for 16 and I hit I it kill him and then only gain 15 armor.
Actually, let's do this. There we go. Wait, adaptive mutation is really good on the Hornbreaker. Yes! Okay, so I'm gonna take the Light of Seraph. I'm gonna see how bad it is for the uh, Seraph to chase. Hopefully it's not that bad. It's not too too terrible. Okay, so purging Probably it restores one restore one torch. Double stack that is really good here. Oh wait a minute. There's the chase has those power wings that are that have the sweep. <laughs> Oh, but if I put the one horse tome on, because I have the armor, right? If I put it on someone with armor, then they're safe. So I think it's okay to do that, as long as they have armor. All right, magic damage to both ones. And we'll duplicate the ranged brute. Uh, we'll do the magic this one, and I'll do it on a torch. All right, and final, final level. Uh, the Hornbreaker Prince did get ba uh, get the, did get buffed uh, from before I think it was only 4 rage and then now it's 5 rage. Now it was at 1.8 rage on the public test servers but then <laughs> yeah that I guess that got changed to f only 5 rage. I guess 8 rage was just too much. Uh, 8 attack. I think I can handle- I handled 6 attack. It's gonna be really tough. This has to happen. This has to happen. Now I'll put one that guy there. Oh, um... Hmm... I'm gonna bet... I'm gonna do that. Okay, so this is happening, this is happening, this is happening, and then I do that. Ah. Uh, hmm, I don't have my thorns, my spikes. Man, I just need some spikes. There we go. Wait, 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 wait. I think I'm just gonna do it on the back. Put some armor on him just in case. Uh, back and do that. Let me. Try 
try this. Holy! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> wow! Alright, so... Okay, let's take and flame. And... Huh. I do get restore and retreat. Maybe I will take it. Alright. Double stack. Right, burning spores. And lower the cost. Let's let's just spread the love. I just have too many cards. Plus ten. Petty theft, sure. Minus one again. Sure, I'll put it on Restore Retreat. Uh, whoa. Okay, 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 okay. Let's... What do I want to permafrost? Or do I want to permafrost anything? Adaptive Mutation. Yes. Alright, Hellvent. I mean, I do have a... Wait, wait... No, that doesn't make sense. So, I do have Deranged Brute. Oh, but maybe I do just... I don't put the fledgling... I don't play the fledgling imp on the Deranged Brute level. Because if I put two Deranged Brutes on the same level, along with my uh, champion, then I can't put the fledgling yen put down. Mmm, that sucks. Then maybe I just duplicate this guy. X cost cards get plus three to their. Uh, I only have vent as my X cost cards. When you summon the second unit during your turn, gain three ember. Or sting spells get plus 20 magic power. I only have 3 sting spells. This is really good in the early game. And I think I'm gonna take it. Okay, let's purge again. Alright, let's see. I might just fail here because of it is the Seraph the Chaste. And I am the rage build. <laughs> so that sucks a lot. Alright, this is really good. I'm gonna get Ember Drained, so yeah, one here, okay, one here, hmm, let's get rid of that guy, this is a problem. Okay. Uh, this double. This is a problem, but I 
can't if I do this I can solve it. Oh, uh I'm gonna take a bit of damage, it's fine. That is totally fine. Uh that that is fine too. Just gonna do that. Kill that guy. Just play that guy there. And just keep on uh Yeah. Actually it is totally fine. I just have so much rage that you can't cleanse it all. Uh, I can't summon two units. There we go. And I only have only taken two da uh, ten damage. Well, that was. I guess the power, the power of uh, Wrathful Prince. And also the mechanic that uh, if you're hitting armor, you don't get killed by the fragile, it's really nice. And we get Adaptive Mutation. So, okay, three more for Awoken, that sucks, <laughs> but oh well, oh well, so, that was actually pretty nice, it's surprising, it was actually really surprising that we uh, did manage to win that, I guess it is mainly because of the, it's not yeah, I guess it is mainly because of the one horse tome. Uh, because of that, the Hornbreaker Prince can just chop down everything. And the deranged brutes, those were insane too. Uh, I guess I only needed one. If I had two, I, <laughs> I would have just done a lot more damage. But yeah, it was, I guess I could have uh, descended the deranged brute. But I guess, I think I had. Uh, some other card that I really wanted to play out instead of the uh, Descending re uh, Restore and Retreat instead of the Restore and Retreat I wanted to play I think it was one of the One Horse Tomes so yeah that was pretty nice Th this is not much of a challenge it's more of just a fun little thing the other stuff there are a lot more other really challenging uh, challenges, <laughs> challenging challenges, but really like difficult challenges. I will be taking a look at some of those in the next video, in the next run. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please do consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you guys in the next Covenant Rank 25 run. Bye for now.